children hope you are doing good how was the day and this is our third theme so welcome you all to the kids grade 2 english lessons tula putala hondin neda komada da dawasa hmm api me kene ganne ape thumweni themawa satun gena අද නම් අපි පොඩ්ඩක් එලියටම යමු නේද කිටි අපි කොහෙටද කිටි යන්නේ ඔව් අපි ගොවි පොලට යමු අපි ගොවි පොල ඉන්න සත්තු ගැන අද ඉගෙන ගමු we learn about farm animals today so let's go අපි දැන් ගොවි පොලට ඇවිල්ලා ඉන්න කිටි කිටි නම් දැන් සූදානමින් ඉන්නේ ගොවි පොල ඉන්න සත්තුන්ට ඉංග්‍රීසි වලින් So we have come to the farm now to learn about farm animals and also what they do, where they live and what they eat. Api eva gana tigina gamu neda kiti? Egolo kohida inne, egolo monawada kanne, karanne monawada neda kiti? Anika kohi pala inna satun, godak visheshai. E ayi danna wana, egolo apita yamak dena wa. they give us something ehema neda kiti yes so we we'll learn about farm animals first so let's go inside the farm here we have come who is this is a farmer so he let us to see the animals so there are lots of animals in the farm can you see do you all know few names of those කිටි දන්නවද සමහර නම් ආ ගොවි පොල ඉන්න සතුන්ට කියන සමහර ඉංග්‍රීසි නම් දන්නවද yes surely i know you all also know well ඉතින් දුවේ පුතේ අපි එකින් එක ආරම්භ බලමු මේ ගොවි පොලේ සතුන්ට කියන නම් මොනවද කියලා yes here we go the donkey බූරුවා right so donkeys are there to carry heavy loads right so donkeys are there to carry heavy loads in the farm right then we have the horse there we have the horse there aswayo inna right again then we have yes this is the barn right ogulanta goy pole dakkita labena this is the barn okay then we have the farmer we have the farmer govia right then we have the goat here we have the goat elua and there are lots of animals here there is a dog as well to guard the animals especially the hens the dog is there in the farm as well and there is a cow cow is a very important animal in the farm goi pole ina vishesha satek thamai me uh eladena right so next it will be ah it's not an animal but it's a tractor there is a tractor in the farm ha ah, tractor ekak thiyena ne da badu yaha me age niyanna ගොවියට බඩු එහාම යගෙන යන සතුන් එහාම යගෙන යන ට්‍රැක්ටර් එකක් තියෙනවා දැන් yes there are ducks ducks in the uh, farm තාරාවො දකින්නට ලැබෙනවා ගොවි පොලෙහි pig yes ඌරෝ ඉන්නවා pigs then we have the rooster කුකුලා ඉන්නවා yes the rooster and the hen is also there kikilit innawa kukulo kikiliyo innawa then yes the sheep is there bataluwa innawa the sheep is there so they gives us lot of things right then what else yes now we have covered all the animals in the farm right kitty so we'll take them one by one 
and see what they can do. අපි මේගොල්ලෝ එකිනෙක අරගෙන බලමු. ඒගොල්ලෝ ඒ මොනවද කරන්න පුළුවන්. ඒගොල්ලෝ කොහෙද ඉන්නේ? ඒගොල්ලෝ මොනවද කන්නේ කියලා. So just will revise. Right? Okay. What can they do? Then what do they eat? And then where do they live? Right. So let's check on the farm animals. First the cow and there is a pig. What can the cow do? Ela dena te monada karanna puluwa. It can walk. It can walk. Yes, avi dena puluwa. Then again, what does it eat? Grass and water. Drink water and the cow eats grass. Then it lives in a shed. Gava galaka thamai inne, right? So a shed. Where does the cow live? In a shed. Okay. Then again, the next is about the pig. The pig loves to play in mud. Yes, mud at the kisellan karanna uro harima kamati. So the pig plays in mud. Then what else? Yes. It also eat grass and leaves. Kola kano, right? Yes, and also. A sty. Urugala. Apita kiya nama. A sty. Right? Urugala kata api kiya nne. A sty. Right. So they play in mud. They eat grass and leaves. And they live in a sty. Cows. They can walk. They eat grass. Drink water. And also they live in a shed. Okay kitty. Now we have learned about the cow and the pig. So we'll eat. Go to our next animal in the farm. Yes, hens and horses. Hens and horses. Kikin you. There are chicks as well. Chicks, kukul pata, and there is a horse. So what can these hen and chicks do? Where do they live? They can walk. They can walk. They can fly a little. Uh, they can fly a little, and they can pick. They pick. Yes, they. And then, yes, they live in a coop, a hen coop, right? They live in a coop. Kukul koo do tapi kiya na, a coop, right? Then, what do they eat? They eat grains, right? At a jati. Thamai yeh golo kukul kama. Ne the kiti? Calls grains, right? Okay. Then about the horse. What can a horse do? The horse can gallop. The horse can gallop, and they can jump too. They can jump, right? And then uh, they eat grass and also hay. Thana kola saha piduru asweyo khanawa. Hema ne the kiti. Oh, dolo putala danna wani. Meva samahar deval dolo putala danna. No danna deval apni ikhe ne ganna oni. So. Where does the horse live? In a stable. Asa gala tapi ke na a stable. So, kukul kuda to mukad kiya ne pute a coop. Ata pata asa gala tapi kiya ne a stable. Right. So, we'll go to another animal and learn about it. Sheep and goat. Sheep and goat. So these. Animals are very important in a farm. Here we go. Sheep. What can they do? They can walk. They can walk, and they live in a pen, right? It, it called a pen. Fields. Thana pitta ni wala thamai godak pela wata battle wo inne. Then again, they eat grass. Egalu kanet thana kola ma. Tamai. So, next is the goat. Yeah, they can leap. They can leap, and also they live in a shed, and they eat grass and leaves. So, sheep and goats is grass and leaves. Goats live in a shed, and sheep live in pens or fields. Right. Then. There are more animals, ducks and donkeys. 
where do they live what do they do and what do they eat eglo mono the kanne eglo mono the karanne koh the inne ducks they live they eat weeds in the pond then worms and seed podi panu eta kota podi eta jati neda kite and always uh, pond weeds jala je phela ati ne kite so they eat all this right where do they live and what do they do they can fly and waddle right the ducks walk is called waddling they can waddle right and also they live in a pond kokunu wala tamai tarao inne donkeys they very useful to carry heavy loads here and there they live in a stable right they live in a stable just like the horse asagala wage mai they also live in a stable and also they can kick they can kick and gallop too right the donkeys can kick and also gallop and what do they eat they eat grass and hay they eat grass and hay so we learned about farm animals where they live what do they do and what they eat So next there is a important activity for us to do so let's move to the next activity so children we are going to make some farm animals kitty come let's make some farm animals so today we are going to make three animals the cow the pig and the duck so we'll need some colored board and some eyes pens fell pens scissors stapler and glue goi pole ena sattu keepa denek hadamu ne eda punchi duwe pote apita paata paata kola o mana wenawa anda gatta as e wagema platik dam paata platik dam katura stapler ka saha gam so shall we start kiti api patan gamu ne eda lassana goi pola hadanna isalama api tarave khadare ne de kiti so i took the yellow one right so here we have the yellow piece of board so we are going to stay plate like this and we are going to make a nice duck hari malesi me punchi gobi pala hadanna right so we are going to paste the eyes of the duck we go the two eyes and we'll draw two eyes like this right and then speak in orange and the two wings and i 
the sides, right? So until it get pasted, we'll make the cow. Right. So we need a whiteboard. So again, we'll take it as a tube like this. So we'll paste those first. So we'll cut some. And we'll paste some black spots on the cow's body. Here and there. Then we'll have his eyes. First, we'll have his nose ready. eyes on top the nostrils Yes. Um, 
Here we go. Cutting his ears. I'm going to paste it on either side. Okay, so the cow is ready, the duck is ready, and next, what are we going to make, Kitty? Shall we make a pig? Yes, soon we'll make a pig out of a pink board. So again, we are going to make it as a tube and staple it. his nose here you can cut it as an oval shape and paste it the two eyes cut the two eyes and paste And we have to paste his ears. Okay. Right, so this is a pig. So we have made a pig, a cow, and a duck as our farm animals. Aren't they beautiful, children? So let's check what will be our next activity. Let's move to the next lesson. Here we are with our next lesson. Learning about baby animals. So here we have the farm animals and their babies. Govi palayina satun saha e satun ge patauta kena nam. English willing api danaganna one. Right. So here we have the cow. Kitty. Um, and then again, petty at her. We mock the key and English rolling. Wow, petty and either English rolling. Hmm. It's a calf. Calf. So the cow and the baby is the calf, right? And next animal will be pig. What will be the baby pig called? Piglet. Pig and piglet. Cow and calf. Pig and piglet. Next, we'll see. Hen. Chicken. The baby hen is called chick. Yes, chick. Then, the next animal will be horse and a fall the baby horse is called a fall right then here we have the sheep and the lamb sheep 
and the lamb the baby sheep is called a lamb and then we have the goat and the small baby goat is called a kid a baby goat is called a kid then we have again the duck and the baby ducks are called ducklings the baby ducks are called ducklings and here we have the donkey again it's a fall again it's a fall right so duck duckling donkey fall right so we have learned baby animals now we learned what they did and what they eat and where do they live so here we learned about baby animals and next we'll learn about their sounds now it's listening time are you ready to listen are you ready to listen kitty are you ready yes let's listen the sounds of the animals and we'll guess who is the animal okay right ready listen who is that what was that sound a cow yes moo did you hear a moo sound yes it's a cow very good kitty good guessing it's a cow so cow moos right next listen very carefully what's that sound kitty difficult can you all guess what was that sound wasn't it an oink sound oink oink yes it's a pig pig sound is oink 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 right okay then next listen what was that sound a cock yes yes it's a clucking sound so cock clucks right okay then next listen kitty what is that sound what was that animal i cannot guess kitty can you guess let us see it's a horse it's a horse the sound is nay it's a horse the sound is nay right then next one listen <laughs> What's that sound? What is it? Can you all guess? Let's check. Was it a sheep? Yes. The sound is bleat. The sheep bleats. The sound is bleat. Right. Next one. Again, listen. that sound uh, a goat yes yes it's a sound of a goat bleat the same sound right the same sound okay then listen kitty what's it can you all guess Yes, yes. A quack quack sound. Quack quack sound. Yes, very good, Kitty. It's a duck. 
The sound is quack. The sound is quack. Quack quack sound. It comes from the duck. And the other one. Listen. Who's that animal? Can you guess? Tula putala ki ana pulu anda. Kitty. No. Let's check. It's a bray sound from the donkey. The sound is bray. Right. Okay. So, did you all enjoy the lesson? The activity? Yes. The listening activity. So, we learn about the sounds of the animals. We learn about farm animals today. Their babies, their sounds, what they do, what they eat, and where they live. Apiyada, goi pole ina sabtu gana gina gatta. And we made three animals as well the cow, the pig, and the duck. So, you all also can make. What you do, la putala, me goi pole ina sabtu keep the nick. Hada na purdu venna. Emane the kitty. Yes. So, until we meet, in our next lesson. So shall we ask them to take care and say bye. Bye children, take care.